what up, Eric Long Shortman? Y'all see the AI taking over. Okay, I'm about to say they better get my damn ticket. Yeah, man, the AI taking over, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, I said by 2030, it's gonna be a whole different world, a new world. AI is here. They slowly bringing it in. If you had that little, excuse my language, but if you had that little motherfucker right there on the boat, lashing, hanging rod, boom, quick with the quickness. Better yet, the cruise ship. Well, they need porters. Well, not porters, but the bag claim, the bag handlers. Man, can you imagine how fast that job will be done? They bring the, they bring the cages to the scanner, just throwing through the scanner, just like that. Well, not even through the scanner. They had to stack the luggage up. Man, they go. You thought Tetris was something else? This real life Tetris right here. They're gonna be stacking that shit up so nice and neat and so fast. You you don't have to worry about it. They, uh, your back going out. That robot right there. Mm -mm. They ain't going for it. That that right there just doing that luggage bag handle they never gonna get tired y'all just seen how fast they, i don't know like, i don't know if this cgi or if it's made up or what but if it is they they working on it they're definitely working on it and it's moving that fast you don't have to worry about they, somebody saying they tired i need to take a break i need to get some water my back hurt that robot back in that robot back in Excuse me. That robot back is not gonna hurt. Only way that thing I heard is you had to get a piece of luggage and just drop it on them. Oh my bad. So be like the old long show me used to do. They used to hurt people on purpose. That's the only way you get them up out of there. You start hurting things on damaging things on purpose, but then you can't do that because I can only imagine how much they gonna cost. So you mess around let Elon Musk or some one of the other um billionaires make them robots for the long showmen, man. Replace the long shortman. We have a job. So hopefully, you know what I'm saying? We'll be locked in. So we don't have to worry about that. Cause you know, as you see, people are losing their jobs to automation. It's just like far as like in the tech field or certain jobs and stuff. Especially like cashiers at Walmart, you rarely see in the cashier. You might see a couple on, but everybody else is like self-checkout. That's it. Hell, I, I can only imagine how it, it is in uh, Japan. I'm pretty sure it's way more far advanced than what it is over here in America. They, we so behind and everything, but man, yeah, it's, it's about to get wild, though, man. It is about to get wild, and you know, the only thing I can say to prep for the worst, you got to be ready. Get your money up, get your money right. Hell, find your new trade. This right here. Yeah, I don't know how long this gonna be, but yeah, man, this, this not this is not good right here. I'm scared of my damn self. Shit, man. Automation, robots, AI, everything. I have a homie. He worked for the phone company. He said he said the same thing I'm saying. He worked and uh, with the military. Somebody came in, but he was saying, yeah, by 2030, it's gonna be a different America. It's not gonna be what it was as it is. What is we in 2024? So six years. And that's around the corner, you know what I'm saying? So I don't think I can do we just gotta you gotta prepare for it. That's all cause you don't wanna get left behind or, or be lost in the south side yeah. Anyway, I'm Eric Long Shoreman. I'll catch y'all later on another video. I gotta get ready for work tonight. Saw Chick fil late. Yeah, I got to go for work, get the paper, and I'll catch y'all next video. Peace.